filmmakers put their heart and soul into the movie, but the end results are not in their hands. The audience decides which movie would fare good on the box office and which one would not, depending on the heavy promotion and the star powers that the film has. The only thing that is in the hands of the makers is their content. It's said that if the content is good, the movie would definitely be successful. Well, not necessarily. There are some movies in the recent decades that had very good content but did not fare good on the box office and tanked. Here is a list of such movies that were unfortunate on the box office even after having good content in their kitty. Kamiyab One of the many little known or literally unknown movies is definitely the recently released 2018 film Kamiyab. It is the story of an actor who rethinks his retirement plan as he finds himself just a movie away from completing the record of a staggering number of 500 movies. Like the title suggests, every subplot of the film is very interesting that depicts the harsh reality of the showbiz world. But unfortunately in India, talent doesn't sell. It's high time this needs to change. Sanjay Mishra's versatility and brilliance is seen by all in different films, but since he's not one of the stars, his caliber often goes unnoticed in several movies. Even with a greatly talented cast of Sanjay Mishra in the lead and Deepak Dobriyal, the film failed to garner the sale of the tickets. It's true that it didn't have a single star power in the film, but it surely had a powerful cast of talent. Shahid There are a few roles that made Rajkumar Rao a great actor in the film industry, and the role in the film Shahid is definitely one of them. The film released in 2012 and it was the time when Rajkumar Rao was rising through the scenes into the world of Indian cinema. It surely was a career-defining performance for him as Shahid Azmi in the lead character. He won a national award for this performance, but he was not the star back then as he is now and the film was also not considered amongst the biggies. And hence, despite its thought-provoking content and impactful direction, the movie was a disaster at the box office. Guzarish Remember that film where Hrithik Roshan was seen smiling and laughing with the sad eyes of his character that was trying to hide the sadness behind the laughter. We knew of his caliber and saw it in his character even in their promotion. The film Guzarish, released in 2010, showcased the story of a handicapped magician who files a petition for euthanasia. The story was fresh and nothing like the typical Hindi films. It featured Hrithik Roshan in a dynamic role of Ethan Mascarenhas along with Aishwarya Rai Bachchan and Aditya Roy Kapoor. It had a great potential and had a big star cast, but despite all that, it literally tanked at the box office. Tumbad Tumbad is the original Hindi film that received critical acclaim from everywhere. It was a masterclass of a thriller that had a powerful content worth even an Oscar. The facts of the film were revealed that the filmmakers were indulged in more than six years to complete the shooting schedule. And it also shows in the actors portraying their character, fast-forwarding the timeline in the story. The changes shown in the character seem genuine because of it. It was so powerful and undoubtedly one of the best ever in the thriller genre. However, even though the movie is appreciated well, it didn't manage to cover even its production cost. It's a pity for a film that has content worth of pure gold to be in such dire state at the box office. Swades. In 2004, Shah Rukh Khan appeared in the film named Swades, which is one of the best films in his filmography under the banner of one of the greatest filmmakers, Ashutosh Gowarikar. It is a great movie showcasing a hard-hitting concept of the real India facing battles within with the evils of casteism, child marriage, illiteracy, ignorance, lack of development in rural areas and what not. Despite having the important topic, entertainment quotient and even the star power of Shah Rukh Khan, it failed at the box office. The reason of the failure was probably weak marketing as the makers were sure that they could engage audience with their film due to the presence of Shah Rukh Khan. Also, the usual patriotic movies of the time used to convey the message showing India is a great country while this one had a dialogue that India is not a good country, obviously due to right reasons hailing the defects in the society. Probably it was not released for the right audience and it deserves a second chance. Detective Bhomakesh Bakshi We often wonder about Sherlock Holmes, James Bond and think why India hasn't produced any detective heroes. Well, little do we know that we had one and an impressive movie was made on the iconic character Detective Bhomakesh Bakshi starring none other than our very own Sushant Singh Rajput. The film is picturesque with the depiction of the old beautiful Calcutta. Sadly, the movie failed to do a good box office business even after the admiration of fans and critics. Andaz Apna Apna It might come to you as a shock but the cult comedy classic as we all know Andaz Apna Apna was a box office flop in 1994. The film analytics have pointed out the reason saying that the 90s were famous for romantic and action movies and Andaz Apna Apna was neither romantic nor action. Also, the 90s were famous because of their soulful music and Andaz Apna Apna was a pure comedy with a touch of old stereotype music filled with comedy too. It shows the display of very bad taste of the audience of the time to be frank. This should have been successful. 13B 
Thirteen B is a horror thriller Hindi film released in 2009 with R Madhavan and Neetu Chandra in the lead. The story shows a couple who moves along with their entire family into a new apartment on 13th floor. The lead actor feels paranormal activities when spirits try to communicate with them via a television set. It is definitely one of the best Indian horror films because there aren't many such films and creates a good impact in the end result. But sadly, it didn't do financially well at the ticket sales. So how do you like these films? Have we missed any to add to the list? Do let me know in the comments. Also suggest which content you would like to be reviewed or discussed. If you like this video, make sure you press the like button down below. Share the video with your friends and family. If you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe. Press the bell icon to get all the notifications from this channel for fresh content. Stay tuned for more such sassy and wacky entertainment. Thank you. Signing out.